Yeah. Oh. Excuse me there, Maleficent. But do you really think we're getting anywhere with this Colossus? Hm. No matter. Any less of an opponent would be an insult. It's him! I fought this thing on the island. But I thought it got swept away into the darkness, along with everything else. Listen to me! You two need to get out of here! Do you actually think I'll take orders from one such as you? Yeah, but a uh, Maleficent, I think the Pipsqueak here may have a point. Silence, coward. You will do as I... What? Uh? Ah! <laughs> oh. Pete! Maleficent! Unbelievable! This guy's a lot stronger than what I fought before! No way is this the same guy! It feeds on the glitches? Wait, that's it! Sora, you're not the only one who changed, who evolved within the Datascape. Riku, you want to fill me in? Yes, but listen to me carefully. I know where the bugs came from. All of them. It's your shadow. It's your heartless, Sora. My heartless? You once turned into a heartless. Though you may not remember. It was recorded into the journal along with everything else. Then it vanished. Your memories disappeared too, but you managed to get those back. For some reason, though, the pages of the journal, they stayed blank. And you think my Heartless is responsible for that? It makes sense. Everything in Jiminy's journal revolved around one person. And that person is you, Sora. Without you, there never would have been any entries. This whole time you've been evolving in the Datascape, finding new strength. Your Heartless has been absorbing data and doing the same. It's grown, Sora. Just like you have. But Riku, we put all the data back. That must have at least weakened it, right? I can still stop it, can I? No. I should have realized all of this sooner. Normally, defeating a Heartless causes its heart to be released. Then the heart's returned to the person who lost it. But when you defeat Heartless here in the Datascape, that wouldn't set any real hearts free. Remember, Sora, hearts can't be turned to data. Instead, I think what you released are probably the Heartless's minds. I did all that? But then, where did the minds end up? Where could they have gone? They're right in front of you. Your Heartless has been gathering, then devouring the dark intentions of all the fallen Heartless. That's where it gets its power. From dark data, and now, just like you, it's become something greater, something much more powerful. If something this powerful got into Mickey's world? Oh no! I have to protect them. I'll use the strength they've given me!
possible. It's changing. No, it's evolving. Help a friend. Don't you remember what I said? We always help friends. Even when the darkness closes in on you. All you have to do is look inside. And that's where you'll find your life. Come on, Sora. It's time to do this. <sighs> Maleficent! You're here! You're all right! I found them caught inside a rift in the data. <laughs> we were just fine. You will hear no words of thanks from me, child. Sayonari to the one, two, three of you! I'm out! See you chumps on the other side! Well... I think I'll keep an eye on them on their way out. And by the way, don't think we're letting you off the hook. Pretty soon, the data will go back to its original form. The way it was before, all of those bugs showed up. It's time to say goodbye. What gives? Is it a glitch? There's some kind of lump in my throat. It's not a glitch. That's just... what goodbye feels like. When we met in the datascape, 
it brought back a whole bunch of memories. The day I set out on my first big adventure. The day I made a new friend. A special friend. They all came rushing back to me. I knew that the journal, it's not just a diary, it's a collection. A collection of all we felt. The journal shows what's in our hearts. I promise. We'll tell the other Sora and Riku about what happened here. That way, this journey that we just had will be one everyone shares. The memories will always connect us. They'll be our own special bond. Remember, we're friends forever, Sora. Yep. Friends forever, Your Majesty. It's finally clear. What's that? Why that world they call the Date Escape seems so familiar. Oh? Huh? A book known as the Ancient Book of Prophecies. It's said to be capable of transcribing events that have yet to take place. No kidding. If we got our mitts on something like that, we could finally take over permanent like. Yes, considering legend has it the book can also conjure, making an entire world filled with beings and powers that have yet to exist. Really? A book that could just make up a world? I don't know. That sounds like nothing more than fluffy pink kids fairy tale stuff. It just sounds too good to be true. Ah, but who's to say a fairy tale's not true? And I ask you, how does that differ from this world they call the Date Escape? Ooh. Don't you think it might just be worth our while to search for a connection? Perhaps there's a link of some sort between that so-called journal of theirs and the Book of Prophecies. I'd say with that, we are on to something huge, eh, Maleficent? Ours is not a lost cause. First, we must take possession of this data of theirs. <laughs> Hey, you know, we never did figure out that mysterious message. Guys, big news. A new world has shown up inside the journal. What do you mean? I've found another door leading to extra data. Somebody must have added it once all the other data was restored. And if we explore that world... Hmm. Then we should get some answers about this message. Great! Let's ask Sora to... Hmm? When we fixed the data, everything in the journal went back to the way it started. Remember? 
Which means that Sora's journey through the Datascape, it never happened to him. Why, now he's just the same boy he was before he ever met any of us. I'm fine. My partition isn't affected. But Sora, we can't send him out there when he doesn't know what's going on. Oh. <clears throat> oh. Wait! Hey, Riku! Could you help me get back into the Datascape one more time? Sora, this was the day that your journey began. I know, because I was here too. It's time for the truth. Where am I? How'd I end up in this place? And who are you? I'm Mickey. I've come here from another kind of world. Another kind of world? Their hurting will be mended when you return to end it. It's a message, and you're the only one with the power to solve the mystery behind it. So we really need your help. Power? What's that? Whoa! What's that? You may not remember, but it's clear you still hold the power inside you. Think you'd be willing to lend us a hand? You might help us figure out the truth. Gosh, I don't have a clue what's going on. I don't, but at the same time, what you're saying feels kind of familiar. So this truth you're talking about, do you think it involves me somehow? Actually, I'm not exactly positive. However, I get the sense it's something important you need to know. If it's information that I'm supposed to know then, well... <laughs> okay, Mickey. I'll help. Thank you. Let's go. Just follow my lead. Whoa. So you think the truth's hiding somewhere in here? Hey, Nikki? Guess he went ahead. Oh, who are you? Me? I'm nobody. In this place, to find is to lose. And to lose is to find. That's the way of things. Here in Castle Oblivion. Castle Oblivion? That's right. Here you will meet people you know. People that you care about. Uh. Huh? It's a kind of card. With a picture on it. Use that card and press on. You will find the truth that sleeps up ahead. Well, wait! But how am I supposed to use this? He could have told me that much. And why does he seem so familiar? Oh. What just happened to me? Oh. That card's special. It will cause you to see people. Well, illusions to be exact. They're from Jiminy's journal. It's all of the very same data that you worked so hard to fix. Jiminy? What did I fix? I don't get it. My mistake. Someone must have pressed the reset button on your memory. All you remember is leaving the island. 
Just the same, you'll remember the folks you meet here. At least you should. I don't understand. What is it that I'm supposed to do? Whatever you want. Huh? There's no script to follow. The journal's the closest thing you've got. But that doesn't mean you'll see the things it says. And who really cares? Everything that happens here, and everyone you meet, is just an illusion. So then, I can do whatever I want to do? Yes. Hey, come back! He's gone. Huh? Well, you did it again, Sora. Wait a sec. Riku, why are you here? I've got something that you need to see. It'll help you. Yeah? What is it? A hidden truth that's nowhere to be found, even in the deepest corners of your memories. It's something I want you to see, and something I want you to feel. I know you wouldn't ask if it wasn't really important. I'll do it. Thank you, Sora. Now, close your eyes. Wasn't that... Riku? And Kairi? That's right. I was on a journey to find you guys. Darkness had taken a hold of my heart. And Kairi had lost hers completely. But at the end of your journey... You would have saved us, Sora. Think about it. What did Kairi and I have in common? When you watched... What did you feel? something you have in common. It was hurt. We had both lost ourselves. And we were hurting in a way we'd never hurt before. There's no greater pain in the world. I ask you, Sora. What would you have done? I would have helped you, of course. Both of you. I'd have figured out how to undo the hurt. I thought you'd say that. And you're right. You would. Or should I say, you will. That's a relief. Hey, then what was with the sneak preview? I just wanted you to see. You always make the right choices. On the road ahead, more than one truth will come to light. You'll forget things, lose things that you care about, and it won't always make sense. It'll be frustrating, and it'll make you angry. It may even hurt so badly you'll feel like you're about to lose yourself. But don't worry, Sora. That won't happen to you. You won't let it. You're like a sponge. No matter how much pain they throw at you, you'll suck it up and leave things a little bit better. Just follow your heart, and you can change the lives of not one, but many. You don't have to do anything special. Just do what you do. Be yourself. After all, that's what you're good at. Do what feels right to you. You got it. Take care, Sora. What? Weird. No one's here. Well, Sora? How was it? Did you have fun chatting and hanging with the ghosts? 
You shouldn't call them ghosts. Sure, something was a little off, but I'm certain those three are still my friends. Friends? You don't say. So then what were their names again? Tell me. Oh, I don't even have to think. Huh? What? Why can't I... remember? I know them. Like I said, everything in this castle is just an illusion. And once the illusions vanish, you'll forget all about your little reunion. I'll forget? Hey, no big deal. The fact that you can't remember them just means they weren't very important to you to begin with. Isn't that right? That's not true! Of course my friends are always important to me! Okay, maybe I forgot what just happened and who I met inside that room. Trust me, I know I'll remember everything again. Hmm, sure. More cards? All of these cards were created from the data in the journal, and all of them will show you more illusions. But from now on, the illusions won't be of your friends. You're fresh off the island, which makes everyone you meet total strangers. Here's a fun little thought. The folks you're about to see, you can fight them all you like. Huh? What do you care? They're only strangers. Actually, illusions of strangers. Just a collection of empty bits of data. They won't be able to make the distinction between what's real and what's not. They'll look at the white walls of this castle, and what they'll see are the worlds they call home. Anyway, the truth would be wasted on them, so why bother? They're only there until they're not. Do you see where I'm going with this? Nothing's real. You can break the little hearts they don't have and then forget about it. No hurt feelings, no baggage. It's that simple. You don't have a heart. It's 100% guilt-free. That's what you think. What? It's obvious you know nothing at all. Everything you say is a lie. I might have the strength to hurt someone, but what exactly would be the point? I know that it would tear me up inside. That ache would stay with me for a long time. You might not know it now, but I hope you'll see that nothing is guilt-free in this world. You've arrived at the first question. Huh? What's with that guy? So, with these cards, I'm gonna run into people from the past. I have no idea who, but it'll be fun. I wasn't kidding around. I really can't remember who it was I met just now. Or can I? Hmm. I give up. I don't remember. That's weird. I don't know what this is. Wait, is this... what heartache feels like? Just thinking about them... causes pain inside. Hold on. If I really forgot about all those friends completely, that would mean I shouldn't be missing anyone. That makes sense. So, I haven't forgotten all of it then. There's got to be more I still don't know. I just need to find something to trigger my memory. Nice! Here goes!
So, Sora, how was your time with... who was it again? I can't remember anything at all. But you already knew that, didn't you? You seem pretty calm. Guess you decided they weren't worth stressing over. Out of sight, out of mind, right? That's wrong. What? It's like you said. Everyone I met, I can't remember. But still... I'm frustrated that I've forgotten them. I feel moments of loneliness. You said there would be no hurt feelings, but I am hurting. When the memories are gone, they just leave a hole. And having that longing inside me hurts. But it'll help me somewhere down the road. It's the key I'll need to unlock all my memories. Right on schedule. The sadness of knowing you forgot someone who matters to you. Something like that will gnaw at you forever. But you believe that somehow by carrying around that kind of hurt, you'll be able to retrieve the memories you lost. That's what you're thinking. Right, Sora? Right. <laughs> What's so funny? I can't believe you fell for it so easily. Huh? I told you when you arrived. Remember, in this place, to find is to lose, and to lose is to find. Well, you've lost your memories, and the only thing you found in return is hurt. And by deciding that hurt was the key to remembering, you gave up all hope of ever being free from it. The hurt owns you now, Sora. Don't you see that? It's a wound that will never mend. That hole in your heart will grow bigger until darkness finally claims it. The darkness? Was this all just a big trick to pull me in? Afraid so. And all it took was a handful of illusions. Your heart was just way too easy to break, Sora. Not true! It's not too late to run. Huh? Why should you keep the herd inside? Just tell yourself you need to forget about the people you met in this place. You'll have no one to miss. No cause for loneliness. No hurt to keep eating away at your heart. Sora, it's your call. Cling to the memories you've lost. And the hurt they bring till you're dragged into the darkness. Otherwise, let it all go, and then you can be free and happy. The decision is completely yours. Wait! Should I use this? But if I were to do that, then I'd meet a friend and forget right away. I don't know if I want that. It's just going to bring more hurt. And if he's right, the darkness will eventually take over me completely. But I don't see any other way out of here. 
guess this card is my only option. That is, unless I let go of the hurt. Once I go out of this room, I'll forget all about what happened and everyone I just met. Instead of carrying that hurt around until it consumes me, maybe I should let it go. What's inside my heart? What am I supposed to do? I feel so lost. Hey, Sora! Can you hear me? Sora! Huh? I know that voice! Mickey, is that you? Where are you? Sorry, Sora. I'm still trying to find a way to get to you. Right now, the best I can do is to send my voice to where you are. It's okay. Hey, Mickey? Maybe you can help me with something. I keep forgetting people I meet in this place. And this guy says if I dwell on what I've lost, the hurt is going to take over me. And I don't want that. I understand. Question is, are you okay with letting go of the folks that you've forgotten? Huh? Who are they? Well, even though you may not remember them, they definitely remember you. You'll always be a really close friend to them. No matter what happens. Yeah, we've been an adventurous, and I'll never forget you. And even if you don't ever really know who we are, I hope you'll remember that. You'll always be special to us. How can that be? Why don't you ask your heart? What are you feeling right now, Sora? I don't know what this is. Who are these two? I don't think that we've ever met. But I feel like... I know them. Memories can disappear, but feelings don't. Not even when your data was reset. Inside your heart, the adventures you shared with the friends you made in the datascape will always live on. And you know what? I'll bet that's also true for all the time you spent with the folks that those cards showed to you. So it's not what's missing that's causing the hurt. It's actually what's not missing. If that's true... Hey! Uh oh Looks like I've used up too much power. I'll be there soon, Sora. I promise. Just try and hold on a little bit longer for me. Okay? Mickey! I'm all alone again. I hate feeling like this. Oh. I wonder, does this count as hurt? If I let it, will this pull me into the darkness? Hmm. I can do this. There's no going back. Just one more card. 